Hello, hello, everyone, and welcome to the third, I think this is the third episode of the Fire Emblem Conquest Relay. Uh, for those of you just joining in on this video who haven't seen the first two parts, this is essentially a playthrough between six of us, uh, where we each play a chapter and then pass the save file on to the next person. And so uh, Zoran played chapter six, uh, Balk played chapter seven, and I am inheriting his save file, and I'm going to play either Paralog 1 or Chapter 8. Spoiler alert, it's going to be Chapter 8, because I don't feel like doing Paralog 1. Uh, for those of you new to my channel, you might realize that most of the content I have made up to this point has been Fire Emblem Cypher related. Uh, if you guys want to get into Cypher, I could link the Discord in the down there part. Uh, but, for this playthrough, I'm going to be playing Conquest, uh, so I feel like the main demographic of my subscriber base is a bit different from the other people work that I'm working with on this, but that's something that can be managed. Anyway, I haven't opened the save file yet, so I wonder what Balk did when he got to Chapter 7. Uh, I'm especially interested in whatever he did with the first Heart Seal. What the fuck? Okay. Well, uh, that revealed everything uh, to me, so let's see. Uh, Corrin's cracked from the looks of things. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> we, we take those. Has Silas leveled speed at- Oh, that's really good. Okay, well, this chapter is going to be pretty easy. Great Knight Arthur is... Well, I'm not sure what to do with that. Um, why is all of his equipment benched? He comes with axes. Why are those in the... Why does Jacob have those? The heart seal was used on Arthur. And the master seal. Wait, do I have any money? Wait, how did he get both of those? You start with 3,000 gold, don't you? What's a 5,000? I actually don't remember. Uh, a freeze was used. That's cool. Okay, I can work with this. Uh, Arthur and Effie. I can work with that, too. I can work with that, too. Um, I mean, these sets are pretty good. He'll have good dual strikes, and he's good for that, at least. I'm definitely wondering why he has those when I don't have a heart seal available. Not that I'm really complaining, mind you. Uh, take. Take, take. Um, he'll be decent, at least. He'll be good for now. Um, that at the very least makes this chapter relatively easy to work with. Wait a minute. Where is... Wait a minute. Something's weird here. I have a dragon vein point. Oh, why did why did you why did you remove this? why would you scare me like that, Bach? Why would you do that? To me? Uh, anyway, I'm not an idiot. I'm building jet. Actually, um, do I need the armory? I'll build a jet. Arthur should not need a weapon for anything he has to do, though. So I could technically get away with not building the armory right now. I can build, like, the lottery shop instead. It could be funny if I hit something good. Uh, I'm not really expecting to, though. I'll build this, too. Um, there's literally no reason not to. Uh, in case you guys haven't noticed, I have hacked in, no, not I, I'm pretty sure either Zorn or Bok did this, uh, hacked in infinite gems and resources. Most people who play the game do this, it's just a quality of life thing. Like, in the long term, you are basically guaranteed to have as many of these items as you need, so hacking in 99 of these things just makes things more consistent. If you really need more gems or more food to make a strat work, you can just wait an infinite amount of time to get it, so it's fine. Um... 
Yeah, I don't think what I select here is gonna matter. At all. Actually, how much money did you leave me? How much money have I inherited? Motherfucker. Okay, I, I, I have no money. That's probably fine. I hope it's fine. Um, I have to remind myself what the benchmarks on this map are. I have to remind myself what the benchmarks on this map are. I should have known that I'd have no money when I saw Great Knight Arthur, but, you know, I, I, I could be hopeful. Um, so Arthur should be able to get enough speed to kill Flora with relative e Wait. Oh, wait, no, Bach, you fucked me. <laughs> this strat no longer works now, because Arthur doesn't give a speed on Parap anymore. Okay, I have to think how I approach this. Um, I imagine Corrin probably pairs fine with Silas. Uh, okay, tell you what, I'm gonna make a quick cut, and then when I find a strat for this map, I will unpause the recording and actually play the chapter. Okay, so I've thought about it for all of like five minutes, and I realize that this doesn't screw my strategy that much. Uh, the reason why I panic a little bit is normally you have Arthur as a fighter for this and Arthur's Parapones is really good. Um, he gives a bunch of strength and I think two points of speed. And so the standard strategy for this map, um, among other things, is having Silas or Paladin Jacob with Arthur support uh, walk up in front of Flora and just Decker on enemy phase or player phase for that map. It doesn't really matter. Uh, Silas can't really reach that benchmark without it. Um, I mean, he technically can, but I have no money, so he really can't. And so, the next best option is using Corrin. I think... I actually didn't do the math on Corrin's attack power, but... Uh... Yeah, it should be fine. I, I, Corrin's attack power should be fine. If it's not, it's gonna be very embarrassing. Um, and... The fighter that follows up won't kill her, so it should be fine. Uh, the only thing I'd really be afraid of is not being able to intercept this guy in time, but I think it should be fine. I can... I can send it. <sighs> Careful out there! Uh, what are anime? Okay, they're off. I can hit A. I can hit the A button when I feel I'll like this A is what I have set to LR. Ah! Here I am. You have my support. Um, and then you can go here. Uh, Silas doesn't have to go. Silas can just go far enough to pick up Envy. And then Effie goes one, two, three, four. So Silas can go here. Careful out there! The darkness right. whispers. Uh, early game lunatic is really easy when you play it a bunch of times because you know what all the strats are. I am you, you, college, you, please. you. Wait, I'm an idiot. Let's make this fun. <laughs> Run it back! <laughs> okay, this is the third time I'm doing this map. Uh, the first time was just me doing something stupid. Uh, the second time, my Citra crashed randomly. Um, which is annoying, because I have to do the first five turns all over again. Luckily, I played like garbage last time, so uh, hopefully I don't make the same mistakes this time as I did last time. Um, but yeah, this, this clear is fun. Um, right. I'm probably not going to include this the we last this attempt, uh, ah! just because it would be a bit redundant, because I'm doing most of the same things, You'll be all and right. there's no point in showing it. Show me uh, what you've got. Be careful. However, this yeah. time, I will actually uh, do things the way I am supposed to, and not, you know, Everything will be fine. it. What did I press that caused it to crash? You know what? Not right, important, so long as it doesn't happen I'll again. Handle this, miscreant. Uh, this is the normal strategy that people do on this map, uh, by the way. Uh, so what turn 2 usually looks like is 
Miles Curse Bowden goes blood. to this tile or this tile. This tile's better. I am Fate's accomplice. Goes here, kills this guy. Um, that myth does not matter, really, uh, so long as these mages die next turn. Uh, as many people as reasonably I'll possible On my honor make their way team. all the way out here. Be steadfast. Let's go. Let us join our strength. And then you're going to go here. Last time I did a bit of a spit and put Corrin in range of a bunch of mages. We're not going to do that this time. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Corrin can reach from here, so I can tell. So I can separate. In the name of justice. The mages won't be able to hit from here, so it should be fine. Right, everyone's on the lake, and then Elise sets off Dragon Bane, so the enemies cannot move onto the lake, so all those guys don't move, and the mages have to attack Niles from two range. Uh, we separate Horn and Arthur because they can just re-pair up uh, next turn, and they are going to, Horn specifically, is going to slam into Gunther at about a thousand miles an hour, roughly. Now, the reason why I panicked at first is that most clears use Silas or Paladin Jacob to do that. Um, they are the most reliable right. methods for doing this. Uh, no by the way, my computer us. sucks, so there will be the occasional slowdown, which is a bit of a whoopsie. Um, this is how this usually works. I apologize. Yeah. So long as that doesn't miss, everything's perfectly fine. Um, someone has to kill this guy. I can let Jacob do that. I don't think they have a problem with that. Um, and then... Two of these guys swing into Corrin isn't a big deal, because Corrin should get Guard Gage, I think? I mean, she doubles, so she should get Guard Gage. Uh, let's we have no choice. Do... I have faith in you. Don't care. We can do this together. Yeah, careful out there. Instead. This should be fine. Hey, don't forget and about me. And then Elise can just go full send in this direction. Such a tease. Separate. Yeah, that's fine. She doesn't get double. Oh, well, that's convenient. <laughs> that's pretty convenient, actually. I'm here to help. Uh, and then these guys fly over here. Uh, this isn't... Well, actually, no, this is safe, because the Lancer's gonna ignore Horn. So, this is pretty safe, actually. Uh, and then... This is also pretty safe. Uh, so long as whoever secures this isn't in this guy's range. It shouldn't be too hard to accomplish. Uh, maybe I can secure an Odin kill. That would be pretty nice. Not sure how oh, exactly oh, I accomplished oh, that. Oh. Actually, I know exactly how I accomplished that. The chosen hero arrives! Kill. Uh, Odin's pretty good, by the way. Uh, I know you that the me. people coming over from... The Cypher Discord, who I expect to be watching this, maybe, possibly, hopefully, um, I'll be your are ardent Odin deniers, just like the rest of the so called freethinkers. However, I am an Odin believer, and Odin's actually pretty good, just not on this chapter. God, not on this chapter. On guard. You would not believe Odin is like a remotely competent unit based on his performance on this chapter. Base is entirely too low, can't double anything, can't damage anything, gets so two shot exciting. by everything on the map. This but, should be simple. Uh, next chapter, you can taunt right, him up. Come on. You have access to Nosferatu. Uh, you can do Paralog 1 at basically any time. Uh, so, he's super easy to salvage. 
we can do and this he's very worth salvaging for reasons that I'm sure I'll the next them. people uh, going after me will get into. I am Fate's accomplice. Um, I don't care. <laughs> Give it to give it to give it to Niles or give it to Odin, give it to Niles. I don't need the XP. Let's start pulling you two. I like the idea of doing that. Check out my skills. Um I don't I want to give Odin the bonus from Elise. But I also don't want Odin to duel with Elise. I want to duel with Silas. Uh, seven res should be fine. Seven res should be fine. If he's only in range of one of them, seven res should be fine, and I'll end up baiting them both, so it's actually fine. It'll work out. We stand together. Yeah. Uh, like I said last time, this chapter is the early game of Conquest is pretty easy when you uh, play it a bunch of times. The late game, not quite as you. much, but it's not that bad. Um, because you get some really, really broken units in this game. Oh, that's not what I wanted to see. It's fine. Um, that pulled more units than I really cared to, though. The bright side to that is that most of them are not really in range to hurt me, so it's really just a matter of kill this guy, deal with consequences later. My aching blood! Um which I mean I'll handle this Hello consequences. Uh I don't like the fact that this guy exists, because this guy's hurt like bastard. Can't I'm Arthur just slam down. into this guy? Mmm <laughs> Big asterisk. Step Big down, asterisk fiend. on Slam. Uh I could just be a coward and kill that. I'd kind of rather use Jacob here, honestly. Jacob will... Honestly? I don't mind that. Maybe someone does something funny with Jacob. Who knows? Uh, I need to not be a complete idiot, though. But yeah, Jacob should do this fine. I just have to be kind of careful. And... Uh... Will I need to pair someone into him? Is a good question. Because 23 on 8 is quite a lot. Uh, most of these guys cannot hit back here. So I guess the operative question is can Sa. Oh, wait, he's in battle range. Uh, is that. Three. Is that minus three or minus two? That's minus three. So he has eight res. Uh, he doesn't have a lance in his inventory. So someone's gonna be very disappointed in us. <laughs> Zoran's gonna be very disappointed when he gets the Silas back. Um, Seventeen attack, eight res. At least is next to it. Yeah, he'll, he'll be fine. There aren't too many of these guys swinging in. Well, Oh god, how many of these guys are attacking them? Just the one. Did I enter? No, I didn't throw. No, I didn't throw yet. Careful I'm pretty sure I can just... You are not alone! Let me help! Careful. Yeah. Oh, why not? Uh, hopefully, the worst case you. scenario doesn't happen. You're but no I match think for us. we will be fine. I have enough gas. Okay. This is um. This is what I don't like. There are uh, eight units here. <laughs> there, there are eight units here, which is uh, not 
really what we want to see at all. I have seven units that can damage anything. Two of which are critically injured, by the way. So, I'm gonna play this again. I could just peel back. I have a lot of room to work with. Yeah, I have a lot of room to work with. I can just peel back. I have to be a little careful. Yeah, I just have to be moderately careful. It should be fine. Yeah, that should be moderately fine. If I can kill you, then maybe. But also, will they just keep attacking me? Because I should be able to just get them all you out. You rely of on me. Let's do this. Uh, let's see. What would you like here? Five. One, two, three, four, five. Together we shall protect. I'll protect you. One, two, three, four, five. Let's do this together. Oh wait, no, that's not where I want to be. The be in range of this guy, right? So it's more like. Uh, Five is where he can move. Oh, please. I have faith in you. You are in good hand. Stand down, fiend. The chosen okay. hero. Arthur should rise. have good strikes. So. Ready for this? I think if I do something like this. That kills one of them, and then depending on how the rest move, because there is an injured uh, corn all the way to the left there, that's a really bad level up. <sighs> that is a comparatively okay level up. Okay, some of them do actually snap back to the base, and by some I mean one of them. I think that's enough for me to make a move here, actually. If I can, like, dual strike a mage somewhere, then we should be fine. Uh, but also at least can heal, so I'm actually not that scared. This should be quick. Uh, Effie needs to hit... What is my other option? I also need to remember what the buttons on my keyboard are. No. No. Give me a sec. It's been a while since I played this, so... Give me a sec to remember what the buttons on my keyboard are. There we go. Uh, 22 plus 7 is not good enough, actually. I don't want to rely on it. Uh, he has a bronze land. He has a hand axe equipped. The bronze axe is probably more accurate. Are you scared? Uh, that's more accurate, and it kills. So Arthur, don't miss. Thank you. You are not uh, alone. Do you kill? Yes. I won't let you down. Okay, that's not quite enough. Well, Do you kill I'll here? No. Uh, I'm with you. Oh, wait. Do I have someone that kills Careful you? Careful out there. Oh, I might have goofed actually. Um, no match for how us. much does Arthur do here? I mean, Arthur does a substantial amount of damage. So I just need someone to like swing at this maze. You may rely on should me. be fine. That is. Not enough damage, actually. Uh, who has enough damage? Happy doesn't one shot, you know. On guard. The Silas couple. Yeah, and he dies. Uh. Let's go. Ooh, I did not plan this correctly. <laughs> I very clearly did not plan this correctly. I just started mashing buttons, to be honest. That one shot is just not very accurate. Only Jacob was like. Point faster. Uh, if only. All right. Um. Show me 
I guess in theory I could that here. It's just not very accurate. But if it hits, it will technically go. Cool. Uh, we can make the move here now. That's not great. That's okay. This oh yeah, we can make a move here now. Um, I don't want to use Arthur's dual strike, but I can I'll always trade him to the Bronze Lance. And if I trade him to the Bronze Lance, it's actually yeah. really accurate. I'll ask him. Bonk. Bonk. I'll crush and then... Them. That's fine. Alright, see, we went completely unpunished. Uh, well, uh, completely is a strong word. Um, okay, that tile doesn't get hit, actually. Computer? Everything will be fine. Yeah, uh, I have at least least the all the time. Okay. Uh, that's the hard part of the map done. We won't give up. Uh, I'll just do this to save huh. myself on some time. Uh, this is the part where I decide if I feel like playing as like an LTC or milking the map for EXP. Uh, I'm a bit lazy. I don't know if I feel like going for these guys. I don't we can do this together. anything in particular for Careful going for them. Um, we stand together. But I mean, I might as well set the next guy up, okay? right? This will be enjoyable. Yeah, I see no reason why. Allow me to join the next guy up, you know. I believe in you. The chosen hero arrives. Uh, how fast is Sila? Um, I could keep Horn in bow range. How strong is Silas? Plus three, plus three is twenty-four. That that's a one round actually. Okay, cool. We're just not healing for it. <laughs> Let's do this together. Maybe I should pull the other guy too while I'm at it. Um, yeah, I lose literally nothing. Doing so. We stand together. I'll do my best. I won't let you down. Oh, that luck. Thank you for missing. Not that it really matters, but... No. Uh... Yeah, no, I just don't want to kill these guys, actually. I'm just gonna end the map. <laughs> it's alright. Uh, Jacob can do something, I guess. Corn doesn't need to kill. Like, she'll appreciate the kill. So excited! Uh, just feed her. Let's uh, do this Niles, together. can swing on this guy. Sure. Uh, it doesn't kill, so I can feed the kill to technically anyone. This will do. That's pretty good, Jacob. I vibe with that very much. Uh, -oh. what now? uh, heal. I'm just doing this for XP, to be honest. The faster she gets to promotion level, the better. Um, You're not alone. while I am here, on a more anecdotal note. Oh, I need someone that gives two points of speed. Jacob gives two Ready points for this? of speed. Action. You have my Strength support. Is everything. Uh, as for what to do with supports, honestly, I wasn't thinking about that this chapter. Uh, I'm going to take my cues on supports from the it's others team up time. for now. I actually haven't thought of supports. Yet. I've thought of a few funny things I want to do. Uh, none of them have anything to do with supports. Would it really be that hard to- Nope. Nope. I'm ending map. 
Uh, and it's honestly not actually hard. Um, wait, I thought we won round. Uh, 18. Oh! He's on the gate. Uh, Corrin doesn't give You'll be all right. enough speed for him to double. He's a little bit short. Corrin gives one point of speed. I checked earlier. So. Whoops! <laughs> yeah, that's really all I have to say about that. Uh, I don't have a way of boosting his damage either. Which is kind of frustrating, actually. It's probably fine, but it's kind of fun. Check out my skills! On my honor as a knight. Um, it'll be fine. You are in good hand. All right, come on. It'll be fine. This kill won't be that we can hard. We do this to together. Here, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. You have my support. In fact, um. Okay, it's enemies within two shots. In the name of justice. Here I am. And Corrin doesn't win. Oh, that's a lot of damage, actually. Which is fine, but yeah, that's a lot of damage, actually. Uh, my aching blood! Uh, you heal for 10. So, not great. Um, oh, so why not? Here, kill, please. You heal for something I can like do this. See. That's not what we like to see. We have no choice. Um so here. I won't let you down. Let me help. Here. This should be secure. Right, because the lance should just be more active. Let us join anyway. our strength. And is the lance just stronger than the sword? Five, six. So it's like a point weaker, but should be good enough, I think, for him to secure the kill. Check out my skills. Oh, is seventeen enough? With Demazel, it should be, because he's getting. Uh, for those who don't know, um, when your unit has weapon triangle advantage, uh, weapon rank bonuses disappear. So, uh, if you do the math on this guy, for example, he has 15 magic, uh, Nosferatu has 7 might, so in theory that should be 22 attack, but as you see here, he has 25 attack. Three of that is coming from the Uh, with weapon triangle advantage, that goes away. So, you can see, with the... Axe 23, the lance 18. That is minus 5 damage. Why 5? I'm not 100% sure. Three of that, at the very least, is coming from using this. One of those, I'm pretty sure, is just from raw weapon triangle disadvantage. I am not 100% sure. Oh, yeah. And then. Actually, yeah, this swing from advantage to disadvantage. So, in theory, how much damage You're was I taking low. again? 19? So, if oh, I park a leaf here, click the heal button, that's Demazel, right? That's not Demazel, that's the least boy is kicking us. No C rank is cool. Uh, give him the lance. See, Zor Zoran can't accuse B of uh, neglecting his weapon rank now, because, uh, we I'm not no actually choice. doing that. And now, uh, this should hopefully be fine. I hope it's fine. <laughs> I hope it's fine. Uh, as in, I hope he doesn't miss this. Oh no, it's fine. Yes. All right. uh, I unfortunately didn't get to do anything noteworthy this chapter, because I didn't have any seals to work with. Uh, it's super early in the game, so whoever gets the first two heart seals really has all the power. Um, but Paralog 
one is still on the table, I guess. So um, I will have to see what I inherit when it gets back to me.